welcome back to my garage. What's more important, high torque or high horsepower? So what is most important, high torque or high horsepower? Well, you can't really compare the two because they are two sides of the same thing. Torque is the rotational force or the potential for work, if you will. Say if it was possible to torque stall an engine, like you could do to an electric motor, and measure with a weight how much pressure it was creating from the rotation, this would be the torque. Horsepower is the work done in a given time period, and therefore it's RPM dependent. Both high torque in low RPM and low torque in high RPM can produce the same horsepower. I'm trying to keep it short and simple but if you want the math, google it and you'll find a lot of information. When talking about automotive stuff, every application has a transmission of some sort. Even direct drive carts have a ratio between the crank and the rear wheels. So there's always a transmission or a reduction ratio from the crank to the wheels. Since there's always a reduction ratio, torque numbers doesn't really matter. Given that their power bands are equally broad, two cars with the same horsepower, one with low torque at high RPM and one with high torque at low RPM, will be equally fast. They just have to be geared differently. Think of it like this. You are the driven wheel. You are blind and deaf like most wheels are. Now you can't see the engine driving you. All you can feel is the force. There is no way for you to tell if there's a giant engine there with a lot of torque but low RPM geared in a low reduction to you, driving you, or if there's a tiny engine at insane RPM with low torque but with a high reduction driving you. To you, both things are the same. All you feel is the force and with the transmission in between you can't differ between the two. So my conclusion is that in a racing application and without any weird transmission restrictions, torque numbers does not matter, horsepower does. Thanks for watching.